from CareCo TV, one of the longest running outdoor programs on television today. Exploring the country and the coast in search of adventures. From the mountains of the great Northwest to the shores of the Atlantic Ocean, this is Americana Outdoors, presented by Garmin. This week on Americana Outdoors, it's all about embracing the challenging task of handgun hunting with Smith & Wesson Performance Center. In this episode, we'll gain some valuable insight into how Performance Center firearms are designed to give you your best shot yet. We'll also hear from individuals who share a love for the thrill of handgun hunting and take a look at several Performance Center handguns in action on various hunts. To get started, Performance Center's very own Tony Mealy is here to share with us a little history of where it all began. Back in about 1989, they brought in a group of guys to make high-end custom guns, and it was really, at that point, geared towards competition shooting. You know, since then, we've opened a broader range of products to include hunting protection. You're looking at a standard product and you pick a Performance Center gun up right next to it, right away you notice it looks a lot different. Not only that, but you start pulling the trigger and you say, there's a whole lot of difference here. You know, Smith & Wesson probably makes, in my opinion, the best handguns on the market today. And the Performance Center, what they do is they make that gun that much better. So we put compensators on, so less muzzle flip. We put integral rails on it. We do action jobs, so your, your trigger's a lot lighter, a lot smoother. You don't have to worry about your mount coming loose because it's integral to the barrel. You can expect about a three and a half pound single action trigger pull out of the Performance Center and about a 10 pound double action trigger pull. And you know, when you're in the field hunting, you've got an animal in front of you, you gotta make that follow up shot. Typically it's not gonna be single action, it's gonna be double action. And that's where that 10 pound double action trigger pull comes into play. You really want Performance Center features, you know, while you're hunting. Over the last few years, Tony has joined us every December for a handgun hunt for Whitetail. From his unforgettable head on shot, at 44 May from the Performance Center, smoking. Congrats, Tony. <laughs> Little boy, good shooting. To rattling deer up close and personal. You put the smack on that one. <laughs> Good job, dude. That's a good shot, Tony. We've always been treated to an exciting hunt when Tony joins us. Let's take a look at his most recent return to camp with the Performance Center 629 44 Magnum Hunter in hand. If anybody's ever saw it, some of the shows I've been on before, they've heard me talk about the Performance Center 629 Hunter. It by and large is my favorite gun to go deer hunting with. Gets the job done, they don't go too far. And if you've hunted with a rifle, you hunted with a bow, you know, you might want to think about trying handgun hunting. It's, it's really fun. I've taken a handgun hunting, you know, 15, 20 years ago. And once I started, that was it. That's all I do. From its custom-tuned action to a chrome trigger with trigger stop and all stainless steel construction, this firearm has all the bells and whistles you'd expect from Smith & Wesson Performance Center. To learn more about Tony's handgun of choice, visit smith-wesson.com and click Performance Center. We're joining Tony in the field where he's just settled into a promising hunting area with lots of deer sightings. Two doe come out into the field. We didn't seem to bother them after a while. They settle down, they're walking around in there, and uh, in comes the first buck. He comes in and he's, he's coming in from the left and he's kind of following those does. I tried to bring the gun up, but he just, he was behind a bunch of bush and he never really actually came in and he went off to the left with those does. Look back, here comes another buck.
Kind of an old timer. Not the best rack in the world, but it'll do. That's a Smith & Wesson Performance Center 629. It's 44 Magnum. One shot, down he went, you know? Nothing like it. Hey, congrats, Tony, on harvesting this great management buck. You can visit smith-wesson.com to learn more about the Performance Center 629 44 Magnum Hunter. Coming up, we're taking a look at how the Performance Center 460 XBR has been built to deliver what hunters expect out of their hunting handguns. And we'll be taking it on a trip across the globe for an exotic hunt. Stay tuned. We know if you found one crappie, you may have found a thousand. We know the joy of getting your boots back in the mud. We know the journey can be more rewarding than the destination. We know the great outdoors. We love the great outdoors. Bass Pro Shops and Cabela's. Stop by today for huge savings on the gear you need and the brand you trust. Plus, free two-day shipping at BassPro.com and Cabela's.com. How do you aim a 36-yard shot with a 30-yard fixed pin at a 15-degree angle with a 7-inch holdover without moving a single pin? Easy. You get one of these. Zero. The auto-ranging digital bow sight from Garmin. The all-new Yamaha Wolverine X2. With a compact chassis, perfect for exploring tight technical terrain. An ultra-quiet and smooth 850-class twin-cylinder engine. And next-level versatility with a 600-pound dumping cargo bed. No other side-by-side -side delivers this level of proven off-road performance. The all-new Wolverine X2 from Yamaha. Americana Outdoors, presented by Garmin, is brought to you by Bass Pro Shops and Cabela's. Your adventure starts here. Garmin Zero, leave the guesswork behind. Yamaha's proven off-road ATVs and side-by-side -side vehicles. One of the standout models of the Smith & Wesson Performance Center handguns is the 460 XVR. This firearm has the highest muzzle velocity of any production revolver on Earth. It's so revolutionary, it required an entirely new designation, XVR Extreme Velocity Revolver. The Smith & Wesson Performance Center 460 XVR, this is a finely tuned handgun. It's got a muzzle brake and an unfluted cylinder, and it's basically been fine tuned for those of us out there that like these big handguns. It's got a smooth light trigger, and it's gonna help you dial in your shots quickly for accuracy. And this is a handgun, in my opinion, that's really designed to provide things that the hunter expects and wants out of a hunting handgun or a revolver like this. When you look at it, it just looks fantastic. I mean, when you hold it and when you feel the balance and you look at the design and the craftsmanship and then you start feeling that finely tuned trigger when you're pulling it and you look at the, what the muzzle brake does to reduce the recoil and the unfluted cylinder and just how the gun is put together and how it performs, I mean, you instantly gain confidence of what it's going to be able to do. And that really came out of the fact that, you know, we're carrying 10 and a half inch guns around. They're a little bit cumbersome at times, especially when you want to get the gun up quick on a stick. So we reduced the barrel to seven and a half inches. Once again, performance center action, so you get a great feel on the gun. But that little shorter barrel makes a whole lot of difference when you're out hunting. We reduce recoil in a couple different ways. One is the muzzle brake. So when a round goes off, we're expending gas out the barrel. It helps reduce muzzle brake. The other thing too is the weight of the overall gun. So you've got a very heavy barrel as well as an unfluted cylinder, which adds weight to that gun. And that's helping to reduce recoil too. So that follow-up shot when you're in a field, it's really important to get back on the target quicker. And by reducing that recoil, that's what we're doing. High vis fiber optic sight get you back on target a lot quicker in those low light conditions too. It really helps out the fact that that fiber optic sight is lighting up. It's got an integral rail, and what's nice about that is you don't have to send your gun out to get gunsmith to have a mount put on the barrel, so you don't have to worry about it loosening up. It's nice and rigid. Obviously, it leaves the factory with performance interaction, so you can expect about a three and a half pound single action crisp trigger pull and about a 10 pound double action trigger pull. Chrome hammer, chrome trigger, once again, help to protect there from elements. 
Pogue overmolded grip. It is a powerful gun, so you want to have something in your hand that helps reduce recoil. And I mean, it's got the finger grooves in it, and it's got a pad in the back of it that, that helps you with the recoil. So your hand's not absorbing all that recoil. The grip really helps with that. It's got a texture to it that really gives you a nice firm grip. Uh, I really like it a lot for hunting. Last year, the 460 XVR traveled all the way across the Atlantic Ocean with us for a once-in-a-lifetime hunting experience in South Africa. You know, we're out this morning on a good opportunity hunt. I'm going to take the 460 from the Performance Center. You know, that's always fun for me to hunt with, and I've been dreaming of kind of getting over here and hunting with it. I've got a Trigicon sight on it, so I should be able to acquire targets pretty fast in this thicker country. We're more in a mountainous area today. There's some big impala running through here, and just like always in this area, you know, you really don't know what you're going to encounter, so you kind of come into it with an open mind. See all the blood right up here on the, on the rocks. Look at all this right here. Got him. Got him up here, Kevin. Done. I aimed right where I was aiming, right here. And after the shot inside a blind like that, that's why I'm wearing the hearing, hearing protection because it's going to echo in there. But I mean, you just kind of lose consciousness at that distance with all that dust and sitting down low, what's going on. But the end result, I don't know, he didn't go 50 yards. That's too cool. Thank y'all. Congrats, Wade. This beautiful Impala taken with a Performance Center 460 XVR will carry on a lifetime's worth of memories. Okay, coming up, we're continuing our coverage of handguns and taking a look at what it means to share the passion and joy of handgun hunting with others. To me, the Performance Center by Smith & Wesson means taking the best and making it better. Regardless if I'm passing on the traditions of hunting or teaching someone new about the outdoors, I know that using a Performance Center handgun will be something they will remember for the rest of their lives. Every model comes with an awesome trigger. They're reliable in all the conditions, as well as offering a variety of sight and scope mounting capabilities. The Performance Center by Smith & Wesson. Performance when it matters most. The Thompson Center Compass II, a feature-rich rifle packed with value and a higher standard of reliable accuracy. Now with Generation 2 trigger and threaded muzzle, offered in scoped and non-scoped versions and in a wide variety of calibers, from the range to the fields to the mountains, TC has a rifle to match every hunter's needs. When you spray on a layer of Sawyer's Permethrin Insect Repellent, you've just sprayed on adventure. Sawyer, we keep you outdoors. Americana Outdoors, presented by Garmin, is brought to you by Smith & Wesson Performance Center. Performance when it matters most. Stealth Cam Digital Scouting Cameras, proven. Wiley X, go confidently. Conquest Sense, hunting sense and dog training sense. One of the neatest things for me as I've gotten a little bit older is being able to pass on different types of traditions or different types of opportunity. I love seeing new people come into this game, say, hey, you know, I've done it with a rifle, I've done it with a bow, 
Now I want to do it with a handgun. When somebody shows interest, it's all about you know getting a, getting that performance center handgun in their hands, getting them out in the field, and then allowing them to have the time to practice because I think that's a huge thing when it comes to handgun hunting. Let's travel back in time to when our cameraman Michael Wersig had an opportunity to step out from behind the camera and experience his very first handgun hunt using the Performance Center 460 XVR. On the Wimmet Ranch hunt, that deer came in, left, came in, left. I had three other deer coming in, and what was going through my mind on that one was, not only do I really want to concentrate and make a good shot, but I want to make sure I have a clear shot and I'm confident I can pull it off. And he gets behind these trees and he just kind of camps out back there for a little bit. I guess he's just eating some of those acorns off those post oaks. Finally, he kind of works his way through this gap and he comes out and he's broadside. It takes a little bit of movement to get everything situated, you know, get your rest, move, throw the handgun up there, and pull off a good shot. Are you good? Are you good? I mean, not only is he in velvet, it's my first handgun buck. I mean, the open sights, it took me a little while to get the feel of it. And God, I mean, that's cool. I love anything that's a challenge. And I mean, I'm pretty much addicted to that. I'm probably gonna have to do that again pretty soon. On this next hunt, we're meeting up with Steve Nessel. After spending a considerable amount of time on the range getting familiar with the Performance Center 629 Stealth Hunter, he's ready to venture out for a chance to take his first white tail buck with a handgun. I know you say this thing is yours, but this thing is mine. <laughs> oh my God, what a great shot, Steve. <laughs> you could talk for days about all the, the different things that are going on with his rack. Uh, the palmation and, and the blading of the, of the main beams and some of his, of his G2s and 3s. He's got a little like tip on one of the top of his tines that mushrooms out. It is just a cool deal. He's, he, he comes, I think, less than two inches from touching in the front. This comes all the way around. Congratulations, Steve, for bringing home this buck of a lifetime. Take it from these guys. When it comes down to it, the most important thing to taking up handgun hunting is not to be afraid to try. Spend some time practicing with your firearm, and then get out and enjoy it. Coming up, we'll continue taking a look at the Performance Center 629 Stealth Hunter. Others decock. We do it safely. The new AccuSlide safe decocking system revolutionizes the crossbow market. Simply backwind the handle, stopping at any point without fear of damage, injury, or losing control. Meet the new Vengeant S440 and Viper S400 featuring the AccuSlide. Speed up to 440 feet per second, 5.8 inches wide. Its three and a half pound zero creep trigger delivers same hole accuracy. The Vengeant S440 and Viper S400 from 10 point. We plan all year for this. We hone our skills. We have confidence in the gear we choose. 
We pour over thousands of images and videos. When the time comes, will you be ready? Introducing the all new 4K camera by Stealth Cam. Proven. Protect it or lose it. 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 Americana Outdoors, presented by Garmin, is brought to you by Angle, the original high-performance cooler. Sawyer Products. Sawyer, we keep you outdoors. Outdoor Action TV. Stream your favorite shows. We're going to be hunting with the Performance Center Stealth Hunter, the Model 629, 44 mag, got a Trijicon SRO sight on there. It's basically a red dot. It's got a great field of view that I'll be able to pick up a target fast. This model is a great handgun for a lot of hunters. It's a very popular caliber. You know, a lot of people have lever actions in the 44. People have the shorter barrel 44s. I like this Stealth Hunter model by the Performance Center. I mean, it's well balanced. The recoil is basically negligible. The trigger is very crisp. So in this scenario here, after practicing a lot on the range, really dialing it in, it's just about now not making a mistake when it comes time to pull the trigger. I've got a love affair with fallow. A big fallow with the palms and perfect points is one of my favorite animals. And so, you know, when the fallow stepped across, he just kind of pranced in, for lack of a better word, and stopped right dead in front of me. It was an instantaneous decision on my behalf to move into position to take a shot. Wow, I mean, we've seen this guy on scouting camera a couple of times and he's been kind of a legendary ghost. I mean, we've seen him way over here, way over there. And I mean, he was just, he's on everybody's list. Anybody that saw him would have a chance to take him. Hunting with the 44 Stealth Hunter from the uh, Performance Center. Just put a new Trijicon red dot on there. The dropping one shot right there in his tracks is, is pretty amazing to me. Wow. Look at this guy. I mean, there, I mean, every palm, I mean, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 points on this guy. I mean, that's just phenomenal. I mean, I'm almost just speechless right now. I just don't even know what else to say. So we, I mean, we talked about this deer all year long. And I tell everybody, I said, man, if you, if you see him, he's going from one end of the property to the other, somebody take him. And uh, I just numb <laughs> when he comes out. <laughs> just numb. <laughs> Weapon of choice right there. The Performance Center 629 Stealth Hunter delivers a powerful punch once again. Every single product from the Performance Center is the ultimate expression of old world craftsmanship blended with modern technology. And the 629 Stealth Hunter is no exception to the rule. From hand cutting and fitting to fine tuning for precision, Performance Center firearms are top performers and are guaranteed to deliver the best performance for your hunting needs. As we wrap up today's show, Wade has some encouraging words for taking your hunting game to the next level with handguns. I feel a lot of questions on handgun hunting on our social media pages, emails, talk about it at trade shows people coming up to me. Man, it's just, it's a great way to hunt whitetails. Every 
Every way is a great way to hunt a whitetail, but it's another way to hunt whitetails and another way to make you smile and grin and another reason to go hunting and master a different technique from the applications to understanding the calibers to the motion of the raising the handgun to the slow trigger pulls and all the different models and all the different styles you can aim with. I mean, handgun hunting for whitetail is another addiction. If you like to hunt whitetail, it's definitely something I'd highly encourage you to do because you're gonna love it and uh, you have another reason to go buy a new firearm too. Hey, thank you for watching and join us next week on a new episode of Americana Outdoors. Americana Outdoors is a Careco TV production. We demand a lot from the products that we use on our adventures around the world. When it comes to keeping things seriously cold, we rely on Angle Coolers, who have for over 50 years kept things cold. Angle Coolers, the original high-performance cooler. Want to know why the top shooting pros choose HiViz? HiViz has an enormous lineup of sights for every shooting platform possible that are clean looking and easy to mount. Improve your shooting with faster target acquisition and eliminate cross-eyed dominance. HiViz sights are the brightest out there, helping you find your target with ease no matter the shooting conditions. Choose the best, choose HiViz, and see what you've been missing. What does it take to make Evercom deer scent? It takes a deer farmer who raises whitetails. It takes mixing the special blend of Evercom, testing each batch. It smells like deer. And then pouring each container. Each container is cleaned, examined, and packaged for shipping. It takes the finest deer herd and a great team of people to make the best hunting scent available. Evercom, from Conquest Scents.